Hello everybody, Conti here with another video. How to make a video clip in colour fade to black and white in DaVinci Resolve 17.2. Inside your edit window, hold in Ctrl and press I to insert a video clip in colour into your project media pool. Use command instead of Ctrl if you are a Mac user. Inside your media pool, find the thumbnail of the video clip that you have inserted. Click on the icon which appears in the bottom right corner of the thumbnail as you hover your mouse cursor over this. To open up the clip attributes, the number next to the clock symbol illustrates that this video plays for a screen time of 7 seconds and 9 frames in total. According to the frame rate, the video clip that I've chosen for this particular project will comprise of 30 stills per second of screen time. This information will help us determine the duration and time points on our video clip, where we wish for the clip to fade from colour to black and white. Select the video clip thumbnail and drag this to the start of your edit timeline. Right click on the media clip on your edit timeline and go to open in Fusion page. Inside your nodes panel, ensure that media in one is selected. Hold shift and press space and go to find the Color Corrector tool. Select this and go to click on Add. With this Color Corrector 1 node selected, go to Inspector and under Correction, find the Saturation Variable. My plan is to create a video clip which maintains its original color for the first two seconds before fading to black and white over a transition which lasts for two seconds. Since the fade to black and white transition will occur after a certain amount of time has passed on my video clip, I must ensure that the frame pointer is referring to the first frame of my video clip, frame 0.0. .0. And to maintain the original colours, select the keyframe diamond icon to the right of the saturation variable, which should contain a value of 1.0. Now go forward on your Fusion timeline to the point where you wish for the fade to black and white transition to start from. Since we already identified that the frame rate for this particular video clip that I have chosen for this project is 30, the two second mark will be represented by frame 60, which can be typed into the box below the Fusion timeline. When you are at the frame where you wish for the fade to black and white transition to start from, select the keyframe for saturation once again. This will ensure that this saturation value of 1.0 will be maintained for the first two seconds of my video. Now go to the point on your Fusion timeline where you wish for the fade to black and white transition to end. In this case here, I want for the transition to be completed after a further two seconds. And so the four second mark will be represented by frame 120. To change your video clip to black and white, reduce saturation to zero. Note how a keyframe diamond icon appears to the right of the saturation variable so that this look will be maintained for the rest of the video clip. If you wish for the video clip to fade back to colour again, simply locate the point on your Fusion timeline where you wish for the fade to colour transition to start from, such as frame 150 here for example. Select the keyframe diamond icon for saturation in the inspector window once again and go to find another frame number where you will reset the saturation value to 1.0. In this case here, I will have the video fade back to colour after one second of screen time at frame 180. Select the frame and click on the small circle underneath the saturation line to reset the value to 1.0. Thank you very much for watching, I hope that video was useful to you. If you found the content helpful and wish to be notified about future uploads on this channel, please like, share and subscribe. Join me soon for another video. Take care.